Alright, hey guys, it's me, and I noticed that there isn't really too many videos, or there isn't really at all, that I could find on hacking the Ken 2M. Uh, I got the Ken 2M right here with me. This is it. It's not the Ken 2, it's the Ken 2M. But what I'm about to do here is, what I did was from the, I had the Ken Twam 2M software on here. Bought it from Verizon, you know, and then... So now I'm it it's downgrading or it says updating whatever it's actually downgrading to the Ken 2 original software. So see now it's probably gonna restart on me. We'll give it a second. Um, if you guys want to know how I did this, all you gotta do is just turn off your Ken 2M and then press R B down and then the power button. Actually and then it'll show up this little arrow thing and then uh, you'll see this just keep it like don't even mess with it after you see the arrow thing just like leave it alone and then and after a couple seconds like 30 seconds you'll see what we, I just showed you there and so now it's restarting and then it will end up getting to the original screen whenever you get the Ken 2 in I mean the re the first Ken 2 so give it a second um, I just wanted to make this video so everybody else knows about this so now I will type in my name Dylan I'm not going to type in my last name because I just don't want to Alright, I'll just enter. Alright, let's enter this, yes. Alright, there it is. So I just entered my email. And connection problem, it'll say that because. You know, I don't. I have this phone deactivated. I got the Samsung intensity, but whatever. Um, well, you're gonna have to press next, and then whenever you're on the screen, it, it'll show up like how it can't connect. And then all you gotta do is just on there put um, cancel setup, like it'll say pretty soon. I'm pretty sure. Just give it a second. Mm, man, it's taking really long. Sorry, guys. So it's. Oh yeah, and then so it's like connection problem. Can't reach the Windows Live ID service right now. Whatever. Uh, just press cancel setup, and then it'll take you to this screen right here. Set up your phone, your apps, whatever your contacts. As you guys can see, I have the Ken Spot now, and then here is my apps. As you guys can tell. It also does not have the calculator or calendar on here, just the alarm, and then there's that help feed reader. That all these, all those things that I just said, the Ken 2M does not have, you know. So right there, um, once you do downgrade to this, you can always go back to the software that you had on it first by just doing the exact same thing. That's what I did. Um, I don't really know how it can do this because I read. That something about how you um, one of the developers of the Ken 2 said that it is impossible to switch the software back because of the fact that how the um, fuses are blown up which you can write the software to uh, I mean I guess that he was lying or maybe he just meant to say something else about how we can't maybe put an Android on here because it's blown up but uh, I read something about that. They said that that is not true, probably. Um, if you want to check this out, just um, if you want to check out about developing software for this, just Google Kin 2M programming, and then Microsoft Answers will show up. And we just need tons of help developing, finding out how to do this. But yeah, I got the spot now on here. Just press and hold the items you want to share whatever also whenever you do this it will 
totally wipe out everything on that you had on your phone and write new software. Um, I wasn't too sure about that. I tried it, and then I had tons of music on here, and now if I go to the music, it's all gone. So, and I have videos. Um, so I wanted you guys to know that too, but you know, it's nothing you can't go and go on your computer, go to the Zoom stuff, and put music back on it. Um, so yeah, if you know anything about programming or anything and would like to help with us, that'd be great. Uh, Alright, thanks guys, bye.